Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Brittany, and if this is your first time stumbling across one of my videos, I do focus on fashion, beauty, and lifestyle. So if that seems like something that you may be interested in, please think about clicking on that subscribe button if you enjoy the content, of course. Also, if you're already subscribed, go ahead and click on that notification bell. I upload twice a week, Tuesdays and Thursdays, and sometimes I'll do a bonus video on Sunday, so I don't want you to miss any of them. Guys, this video has been long awaited, and I have dreaded filming this video okay this is going to be my huge Zara haul honey we have tons of things we have tons of things um, just looking at my rack right now is giving me anxiety but I have my coffee so I'm going to try everything on instead of going through the pieces talking about them on the rack and then just doing cutaways I figured we should do a real-time try on right so we can see how the pieces look and get my reaction because though I've had these pieces for quite some time, most of these are in this from the sale and special prices. So that lets you know how old they are. Um, I haven't even tried them on y'all. They've been sitting in these boxes the whole time. The only pieces I've tried on were three of them actually. So let's go ahead and get right into it. Okay, so let's start with this top since this is what I'm wearing right now. This is one of those pajama style tops from Zara that I am obsessed with. I actually picked up the set, but girl, when it came to me, it had a stain on it and it hurt me, okay? Because I was able to get this on sale. I debated on this for quite some time. I didn't think that the pattern really was me. It was a little too 70s vibes. Um, but then when I got it in person, I was like, I'm obsessed, but it had this sticky hard stuff on it. I couldn't even wash it to get it out if I wanted to. Um, I also had the, the um, what's the other print? It's like the mint white and pink one, same thing. It was a few things in that box that had stains on it. This one I was able to save. And so I just kept the top because I think the top is actually really cute. Um, you can see it's kind of oversized, but I like the slits on the side. And I just love a good pajama style set. Y'all know I've been into these for years and it's not gonna stop. The pants would have been everything, but I can wear it with jeans. I can tie her up in the front, even put on some like white pumps. I think that would be super cute with this. Mm, white Balenciagas, white Alexander Wangs with a little white bag, a little clutch, honey. I'm ready for brunch whenever I go. <laughs> so yeah, I like this top a lot. What do y'all think? Okay, y'all, so here is the next top. Now, let me just tell you, I know I tried it because this is in a size large and tops like this, I already know she needs an extra large, but I loved it so much that I just had to try. Oh, it's so cute, but she's snug, she's real snug. So this is what it looks like on the sides and it does have a zipper to get in and out of on the side, as you can see, and it has like this little frill but it's a little snug. Like I don't, I mean, I can move around in it, but it's a, it's a little snug, y'all. What y'all think about it? It's saving me because it does not have button closures. Let me come and show y'all. So you can see the jewel buttons, but there's no closures. So if there were closures, I mean, we'd be busting loose, busting loose, busting loose. <laughs> but yeah, this is so cute. I love it so much. It's so feminine. Um, just love it but oh, child. Jesus take the wheel and the scale okay because the wheel is taking me to Taco Bell Jeez Louise but this is so cute what y'all think about it definitely should have got an extra large I, did, I mean I couldn't you know it was sold out but this was on sale and it's adorable to me I just love it so much okay so here we have another white top I mean raise your hand if you're tired of seeing Brittany in a white top girl listen it's gonna be a rule 2020 for you honey because I can't stop but I love this top okay I got this in a size extra large this is ecologically grown cotton 100% cotton so it's really cute very breathable um, it does have like this ruffle detailing so you can kind of look a little wide a little linebacker ish but y'all know I live for a puff sleeve so I like it super comfortable it looks nice with the jeans it's not showing too much in the cleavage area and it has like a little bit of an elastic band right there to cinch you in so I think this is really cute I would do this probably with some white skinny jeans just do an all-white look because this can lean a little little house on the prairie y'all know that's my saying but 
um, with some white jeans I think it can kind of sexy it up a bit especially skinny jeans you know show off the shape and yeah gold accessories maybe hmm possibly cute let me know what y'all think about this one and here it is up close so you can see it has that eyelet detailing but it's like large eyelets usually when you see eyelet it's very tiny all right y'all so here is another top love this top it's in a mint green and the material if you can't hear it it's like that swisher suit material like a nylon material really cute very you know 90s fabric but I like this a lot. I love the color, I love the neckline. And you can also wear her off your shoulder if you so choose and show a little clavicle. You know, real cute. Again, you can wear this with jeans, you can wear this with a skirt, you can wear this um, with whatever you wanna wear it with, child. White jeans would be cute as well. I like it. This was dirt cheap. I remember this being like $12. Yeah, like $12.99 or something like that. Something ridiculous, but I like it. What do y'all think about it? All right, y'all, so here is another top that I picked up in the sale. And y'all, again, $15, $12 to $15, no more than that. Um, this is in a size large. I like it, it's very stretchy. It's like a knitted material. The colors were different for me, but I was like, you know what, for $15, I may can do something with this. And I could tell that it was this material because I have a couple of tops in this material and I like it. It's very stretchy. If you remember my um, one shoulder blue turtleneck type top, it's the exact same material. So it's orange and blue stripes. And I think it's really cute for the summertime. Um, you can possibly do something with this towards the fall. If you add maybe like a white blazer on top, I think that could be cute. This, like some jeans, white blazer on top, pull out like an orange um, heel, not a heel, like a sandal or an, a blue, you know, sandal or something like that. But yeah, different for me, but I think it's cute. I like the colors. I'm just drawn to it. And this is what it's looking like. What do y'all think? I would have liked it if it was more oversized, but honestly, even if it was because of the material, it would not have been blousey. Does that make sense? So, you know, it, it's gonna be what it's gonna be regardless. So, really cute though. Let me know y'all thoughts on this one. I know it's different for me, but. Okay, y'all, so this one is one of my favorites. I absolutely love this light pink shirt. It's so cute. And it's super oversized, as you can see. So I could almost wear this as a dress. I would probably do like some really short shorts underneath, um, you know, and a little cute heel, probably my Alexander Wang white barely there sandals and just like a cute little maybe a pop of color for the handbag may do a mint you know like my mint balenciaga bag i think that would be really cute with this um but yeah love 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 this it has the large cuffs and then in the back it has an open detailing y'all see that so it opens up in the back. It's super cute. You can kind of pull it a little tighter if you want to. You can also do this with like some white jeans as well. I just thought that this was a nice twist to a, you know, button down shirt. Let me come closer so y'all can see the sleeve detailing. Really cute. This is in a size extra large. And as you can see, it does run really large, but that's how it's supposed to be. I just love it so much, y'all. I love it. What do y'all think? I think I paid about $20 for this. It was on mega sale and I've seen this a few times so it may still be available. Real cute. Okay y'all, so I did pick up a couple of knits and this is one of them. This is in a really beautiful pink color. I love this color pink. It's like my favorite color pink. I have a little mini Chanel in this color so yes, had to get this. Um, it's like a polo style. You know, these were really on trend. Um, polo style, like very soft, thin sweater and i just i think it's so cute now i did get this in a size large i would have want, wanted this to be oversized but i think this was the last one y'all because i kept on going back trying to find this and once it came in stock in a large i just grabbed it y'all so here is the top you can do so much with this you can wear this with slacks you can wear this with some um wide leg jeans you can wear it with skinny jeans you know style it up style it down shorts whatever have you but yeah i just love the color so that's why i picked it up what do y'all think about it y'all 
I cannot get enough of this cozy knit. It feels so freaking good. It's such a chunky knit. I'm obsessed with this amazing deal. I think I got this for like $20. This is in a size large. It's in a beige color. And as you can see, it just has like a little wrap detailing. That's how it fastens, you know. It is perfection. It's perfection. I think this came in like a mauve pink color as well, but I like, you know, the bone beige kind of color because I feel like you can do way more with it, y'all. This is so good. It feels amazing on. You can kind of scrunch up the sleeves if you want to, give it a little bit more of a blousey effect on the sleeves, or you can just wear it, you know, regular. You can wear this to work, girl. You can wear this on the weekend. It's like sexy without being too sexy. If you wanted to open her up a little bit more, you can put on like a bralette or something underneath that, you know, could possibly show. It's just, it's the bee's knees. It is. Love it. I love it what do y'all think about it <laughs> y'all here is another one that i tried okay this is in a size large i was wanting this suit so bad first of all i couldn't find the pants but i was like i'm just gonna get the jacket and hope for the best and then maybe i'll get the pants later child the pants never showed up again okay never saw them again on the website but here is the jacket this is in a size large okay i don't even have on a top or anything underneath <laughs> This is in a size large, y'all. She's snug, okay? But I do have it fastened right here. So it's supposed to be kind of like an open blazer. I love the cut of this up here. Very suffice, very suffice. This would be super cute if it fit a little bit better. Like, you can tell it's just a little snuggly. It's a little snuggly. But it's so good, right? Like the color is so beautiful. This would be perfect for the office. I mean, I'm working from home, but it would be for those of you who are going to work and care about how you look <laughs> right now. This is so cute. I'm so sad about it, but I don't have the pants, so I guess it's not too bad. I could wear this open. Let me know what y'all think. Should I keep this? Because I can wear it open, but I'm not sure. It's such a beautiful blazer. I could probably just do like a white tank top underneath and some jeans and some white shoes you know white's my favorite um but let me know y'all thoughts on it so here is a sleeveless blazer and i've been wanting this for so long let me just first say the material on this is chef's kiss okay it is beautiful it's like a satin teen thick satin teen material it's just gorgeous think of like a, a nice quality cummerbund for a male's tuxedo that's the vibe of this material love the shoulders how they kind of like sit out a little bit um i would show you it open but i don't have on anything underneath um so but this is so cute i love it it's like an, a crew color this did come in two sizes only small medium and large extra large i got the large extra large and this is how it's fitting it's still done up in the back. Again, I just pulled all this stuff out the box. So, <laughs> But yeah, how good is this? I love it. Let me show y'all the button detailing. The buttons are like this gray tortoiseshell color. Love. Even if I wanted to undo this bottom one, it looks a little bit better. But yeah, I love this. Can you see that sheen? Very cute. I'm, I'm gonna put these on real quick to show y'all, but these I also picked up. Um, I don't know if these were on sale or not. These are Air Fit Comfort Technical Insoles, okay? They have a very modest heel, very modest. And they're very like Bottega um, mesh pump inspired. I have the mesh pumps, but I thought that these would be cute for like summer. <laughs> we don't have one. Summer has come and gone. But let me try them on and see. Yeah, I don't love these already. They look funny on y'all. They like granny-ish. I'm gonna send these back for sure. Let me step back. <laughs> Can y'all see? I'm not feeling, I'm not feeling these at all. They are very comfortable though, but it's a no. It's a no for me. Oh girl, yes. First of all, absolutely, absolutely yes. Thank you so much. This is a cord from Zara. I got this in a size large and I am obsessed with it. Obviously, I would not wear this right now. I picture this for the fall. How good is it though? Woo, yes. Of course, the pants are super long. Y'all know I'm only 5'1". Um, but this is good, girl. Anytime there's a cord, 
on Zara, please snatch it. They do the best cords. Of course, they don't come together, but I got this on Mega Sale as well. I think it was like $20 or $19.99 for each piece. It's so good and it's sexy, but yet I'm covered literally, literally from neck to toe, honey. I love this. So good. Now, let me tell you, getting these pants on was not fun because it's a good thing, but a bad thing. They make the waist good enough, like tight enough to where it fits you nice in the waist. But girl, if you got a hip, please don't have a behind. You're going to have a struggle getting these up. But, you know, once they're on, they look really good. So these are the pants. Y'all see that? And this is the shirt. I just love the silhouette of this. Let me come closer so I can show y'all the texture. Ooh. Oh, what's that? Mm -mm. Girl, look. It's good. I love this. It's a chocolate brown. And you can see the pants are see-through. Pants are see-through. Love it. Oh, so good. I can't. I can't wait. I'm gonna get these um, tailored just a, just a wee bit because I like how long they are. And yeah. Oh, I can see this even with a ponytail, girl. Cute little ponytail. Okay y'all, so here is another dress. And honestly, I was not expecting this material, but I'm grateful for it. So this is a white dress. Of course, it would not be a Britney haul without a white dress. Um, love the puff sleeves on it. Um, again, the material is like a stretchy cotton. It's a nice thick material. It's a nice, um, it feels like good quality in my opinion. It does zip up the back and it has like some darting here. Can y'all see that? The bra is blowing everything, but of course I would wear a different bra with this, but I really like it. It's cute. Plain little dress that you can dress up or down. Um, really, you can wear this anywhere, in my opinion, depending on how you style it. So it's cute. Not too short. Yeah, what do y'all think? Cute little white dress, huh? The puff sleeve detailing is just so good because they really do stay puffy. You can probably pull it off. Oh yeah, you can pull it off the shoulder. That instantly gave me um, House of CB vibe. So I like this dress a lot. I think I paid like $25 for it. Not too bad at all. Let me know what y'all think about it. Of course, I get to style these items up. Let me know if y'all want a lookbook of me styling the pieces up because today I'm just trying them on because I have to get through all of these. But yeah, what do y'all think? All right, y'all, so I have another white dress. I'm not sure how to feel about this one. So it is an off the shoulder dress. I still have my bra on. Um, it's an off the shoulder dress and it has like this little ruffle tear. And it's like a, um, I don't know what kind of material, crinkle material. What do we think about this? I feel like I would absolutely have to wear a heel. It's baby doll-ish, you know, y'all know I love a baby doll dress, but I'm not sure about this one. It's not bad though, you know? Actually, it's kind of cute. I would love to know your thoughts. <laughs> Obviously, I'm indecisive. It's cute actually. But I do feel I do feel like, you know, I'm carrying a child. So, a little prego. I would not feel that because no. So, let me know what y'all think about it. Should I keep this? should I return it? It could be a cute little throw on and go for the summer. Anytime you have a white dress in your wardrobe, like you cannot go wrong. You just throw her on and go. That's been my problem during quarantine. I've only worn dresses, literally, literally. <laughs> but yeah, let me know what you think. Okay y'all, so here is another throw on and go baby doll dress. I really like the silhouette of this one. It's in a Kelly green, very different for me, this color at least. Um, but again, the silhouette is everything. I love the little puff sleeves. It's very plain, um, but you can go out on a date or something like that and just be really comfortable. That's what I like about it. And you can dress it down, you know what I'm saying? It's really cute. I think this came in black as well, but they didn't have my size. I picked this up in a size extra large and the fit is really nice. It really is. This was like $12.99. You can even wear something like this to church. But yeah, for $12.99, you can't beat that. Literally just a throw on and go and you look put together. That is my type of dress, okay? Um, but the color though is a little different for me. What do y'all think about the color? 
we have another throw on dress. <laughs> now you may have seen this one in my um, Shein haul. I hauled one from Shein that literally looked the exact same. The material was slightly different. So this is like a chiffon, um, deep floral, very small floral dress. It has button detailing here so you can kind of button her up. This is very 90s in my opinion, uh, but I have it undone because that's just too much floral for me. I need a little bit of clavicle out. Um, but yes, yeah, very short, okay? Keep in mind, I'm five one. This is very short, but it is flowy. And yeah, this would be cute with flats. I wouldn't wear heels with this, but so cute with flats. What y'all think about it? Even though it's long sleeves, you can pull it up and the material is very cooling because this is literally like two see-through layers. So it's the floral see-through layer and then the black see-through layer. So very cooling. Cute. And we have another little baby doll dress. <laughs> I waited to the last minute to get this as well. I kept seeing this in the sale and I was just like, Mer. like I like it, but I don't like the floral, but I love that it's pink. So I just kept going back and forth, but I finally picked it up for like $12, $12.99. And it's kind of cute. What do y'all think about it? It's, it's kind of cute. I like the high neck. I'd probably fasten her up and do like a ponytail. I think that would be really cute. Now again, very short and I'm 5'1" very short okay so you may want to go up a size on this if you want to wear it like loose i got a size large but an extra large would have been perfect because it would have like skimmed more over my hips but i like this it's cute let me show y'all the print up close how cute it's kind of juvenile in a way but i still like it like it's y'all know i love a high neck i love a nice puff sleeve like it's so cute This is how it looks in the back. Okay, y'all, so here is another little baby doll dress. Now this I thought was cute, but I don't think this flatters me. This is in a size large. It's a little snug up here. I mean, it's not tight, but it's like, you know, it's not loose, <laughs> which I guess is good. Um, but the straps stop it from falling down. So it could have been a little bit looser. Um, I love the color of it, but I just don't think that this silhouette is right for me. I don't know. There's something going on in the boob area. I don't have a bra on, by the way. <laughs> but yeah, so let me know what y'all think about this. Would you keep it? I would definitely wear a strapless bra because it because this is so high up on my neck, it makes my boobs look lower. So, mm -mm. but yeah, let me know what y'all think about this dress. How do we feel? It's very like perfect for the summertime you know it's not touching me at all which i like so interested to hear your thoughts all right y'all so i also have this knit dress and it is in a really beautiful fuchsia color but again i don't like this neckline like the neckline on this is like i don't know it's interesting i have on a sports bra but i just pulled the straps down so you know definitely wear a proper underwire bra i just can't do that right now so <laughs> bear with me um but yeah this is it's a cute dress i got this in a size large it's a madaxi on me but it'll probably be a mini on you guys so what do y'all think about this it's interesting it's a really nice thick material let me come closer it's really thick so yeah <laughs> okay y'all here is another dress that I was on the fence about, but I just kept seeing it. Now this one's $69 at first, and then it went on sale. So I was like, let me just try it out because this is definitely different for me. I love the color, I love the texture. Um, if you're familiar with my videos, you may remember a black long sleeve dress in this same exact type of texture, and it's my favorite baby doll dress. I wear it in the spring, summer, winter, and fall and I love it so much. So that's kind of why I was drawn to this, but she's a maxi, okay? I have a little peel on. She's a maxi, probably a midi for the, for the regular height girls, but again, I'm 5'1", so it's a maxi on me. But I do feel like I look like Big, big Bird a little bit. What y'all think? Do I look like a bird? It's different, very flowy, love that. The quality is impeccable. I can see why it was $70. It's very heavy, um, just like my black dress. So. Do like the quality but i don't know would i wear this 
Again, I may make this a little bit more youthful by doing a ponytail or something like that, but I'm not quite sure. I actually don't mind these blue shoes with it. It just gives it like something unexpected. What y'all think? How do we feel about it? It's so flowy, y'all. Look at this. I feel like a princess, but yeah, it's different. Would I belt her? Let's see. No, I wouldn't belt her. But these dresses are really on trend right now because y'all have seen like the like Moo Moo style dresses. So this may could work, but then would I want this next year? Probably not, I don't know. Let me know what y'all think about it though. Okay y'all, so I also picked up this white jumpsuit. Now this is different. I wanted to try it out. So it is a white denim jumpsuit and it has this crossover detailing that has um, snap closures and I liked the structured shoulder so it's giving like that Frankie t-shirt vibe you know with the shoulder pads. So that's really why I picked it up. Um, yeah this isn't a size extra large. I think I should have gone even to like an extra extra large for it to be a little bit looser. What do y'all think? It's, it's cute but I'm not sure. What do y'all think? Should I have gone even higher? I don't even know if it, it, it may not have even gone up to an extra, extra large, but this is an extra large. So what do y'all think about it? You can also, you know, unfasten it and leave it kind of open if you want to. But I kind of like the little all the way up look, you know? Yeah, this is, it's different. How are we feeling about it? Y'all let me know what y'all think should i send this back because i don't think it has they have a bigger size um or should i keep oh yeah while i'm at it i might as well show y'all this denim little bag it's just so cute it's like pillow material it's definitely giving chanel 19 vibes y'all know how zara does um but i think this is really cute and i just like that it is denim i love denim you guys so definitely wear this it's like a little clutch that'll be cute but it also has like a little short drop so wear it on your shoulder if you want to very lightweight i like this a lot actually they had a black um like denim one as well but i couldn't get my hands the inside of it so it's just a nice big old bag child you can just throw all your things in there it's cute cute if you've been eyeing the chanel 19 and you don't want to spend thousands grab this one it's cute okay y'all so these next two pieces i feel like every single person has these um i have on the infamous bodysuit um like high neck tank top that super soft material now i would recommend you wearing this with a strapless bra or no bra at all you can definitely get away with wearing this with no bra when i, I have an orange one as well and when i wore that i didn't have a bra on because it, it holds you in. This isn't a size large. I think that's the largest size that it goes up to, but it is the softest material ever. It's just so soft. Um, it is a bodysuit. And I also have on this white skirt. Again, everybody and their mom has this skirt. It's really cute. I'm not gonna lie, it's really cute. I love the draping. This is in a size extra large and it's cute. The only thing is everyone says that it's see-through and I'm going to just turn to this one side so y'all can see. That is the bodysuit. You can see straight through it. I don't know if you can see it on camera, but I can definitely see it. So yeah, you can see straight through this skirt. If anyone has a fix for that, I know I could probably wear a slip maybe. Not sure. Um, but yeah, you can see straight through it. So no body suits for this one. If you do a shirt, you need to wear something that you can like tuck in and then like pull it out all the way up until this point so that you can't see it. You know what I'm saying? Because it's literally see-through. But I love the little split in the front. The first person I ever seen with this on was uh, Melissa's wardrobe and she killed it. You know, she kills everything, honey. It's like Naomi Campbell body. Like we don't deserve, but it's fine. <laughs> so we all ran out and tried to get it. Um, but yeah, this is the skirt. Let me know what you guys think. I also picked up this really cute shirt, y'all. This is a beautiful satin um, high neck blouse and I got this on sale as well. It is so good. Like, I love it, okay? I love it. This would be so cute, again, with high-waisted jeans tucked in really nice and bloused out. 
I just love like the high cow neck on this. It's so sophist. You can definitely dress this up with like a suit and even dress it all the way down with like shorts and um, some jeans or something like that. It just depends on how you want to style her. But the satin is what makes it very like versatile you know what i'm saying um i think they had it with a satin skirt i have a satin skirt from zara but it's not the exact same color i thought maybe it was but it's totally not so i missed out on the skirt but i still like the top you know i like the top a lot i have some satin wide leg pants as well i may be able to do those with this but this is just gorgeous like the sheen on this is so beautiful so beautiful I got this in a size extra large. So let me undo it so y'all can see how big it is. This is how it looks if I take take it out, you know? So really cute top, I like it. So soft. I think it was again like 12 bucks. So very cute. I think my coffee is wearing off. <laughs> my energy is like <laughs> no. But um, this is really cute though. Hey y'all, so I also have the super high waist um wide leg fuchsia pants and they're like a cotton nylon material i thought these were really cute but they're really high on me and if i pull them down they sag in the seat when i pull them up they gather in the seat so mm, not quite sure did get these on sale they have pockets and they have this belt that comes with them so really cute i got these in a size extra large and i like them a lot but i just I kind of feel like my torso is a little too short. Look how wide they are. That's what I love. I love how wide they are. I would have loved if these um, came with a jacket. It came with like a peplum top. That was not the vibe that I wanted to go for. But yeah, this was like a suit. It will be everything. So I don't know. Let me know what y'all think. The color is absolutely stunning. You can see they're super high waisted. I'm on the fence. Not sure if I'm gonna keep these or not, but yeah. Here is another pair of trousers. Now these have like an asymmetrical little detailing in the front. It's very interesting. I don't know what this is doing. I don't recall this. Maybe this goes all the way around to the back like that. I don't know why, but okay. Um, <laughs> and yeah, they're different. I don't even know what color these are, like a gray, brown, black. But they're loose in the waist, y'all. Like, you can't tell because I have on this blousey shirt. But they're really loose in the waist. So, and they're not super high-waisted either. And I do better with high-waisted. So, I don't know about these. They're a little itchy as well. They feel a little itchy. I don't have on heels right now. So, I'm standing on my tiptoes so y'all can see. But, yeah, I don't know. What y'all think? They're different for sure but they're loose in the back, tight up in the hip area. Like, I mean, story of my life. Um, but yeah, let me know your thoughts on this. All right, guys, so that is the end of my huge Zara haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I didn't have a lot of like outfits, but I had some pieces. So I'm probably gonna keep a few pieces, but the ones that just did not hit like that, I'm gonna send them back because I have to stop just keeping things. I have way too many clothes. So I have to stop just keeping things just because, you know what I'm saying? So anyway, let me know what you guys liked in the comment section down below. Also, let me know if I should do a lookbook styling some of these pieces like I did a few months ago when I did the Zara haul. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and I will talk to you on my next one. Bye.